Okay, Wednesday. What do we have here? Ooh, new Silver Stars card out. Let's see here. Kamaldine Suleimana. Looks actually to be pretty good. And he's from Ghana. Oh, God. I'm so sorry for what's gonna happen, but it's it was bound to happen. Suleimana is the mana from Ghana. That's good. That's that's the intro. I'm very happy with the life choices I've made that led me to this point. So yes, we have Silver Stars back into FIFA. This is the very first one with Kamaldin Suleimana. Yes, from Ghana, and I will be making that joke constantly throughout the video. Now, I'm excited for this card for just a number of reasons. One, the fact that it's, you know, that means Silver Stars are back. And Silver Stars, one, means that you can just get all of these special informs for free that have pretty good boosts. And then usually, at least for FIFA 21, there were a lot of, you know, certain objectives that were associated with it that led to like 50k packs, uh, rare mega packs, 100k packs, things like that. Two, and probably the most important, at least to you guys, is the fact that this guy just looks absolutely insane, right? High medium work rates, four star, four star. The pace is insane. The agility, the balance is insane. And then with a the marksman goes to 90 finishing, 92 dribbling, 90 ball control. He already has a lean body type. So mixing all of that with, again, the agility, the balance, he's gonna move insanely well. Third, and this is the most important to me at least, is that he is from Ghana. Now, last year I had a huge liking to Ghana players, mostly because of this man on the bench, Alfred Duncan. He was the best player in all of FIFA 21, and the fact that he is also 74 rated, I pray that he gets a silver star, because if he does, that means I can link him, and then this man, Suleimana, who also, again, looks to be fantastic. So, I'm very excited to try this team out. On the plus side, you probably get the best winger in the French League that's not Messi or Neymar. Or that Janola guy that's somehow like two million coins now. So besides those top three, yeah, he genuinely is the best winger in the French League. Now before we get into some games, make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. Let me know who you guys want to see as a silver star, because personally I would like to see, like I said, Alfred Duncan get one. That would be the greatest thing in the world. But enough about that, let's get into some division gameplay, shall we? Now at the moment, I actually am going to be putting Suleimana at striker, because I don't really have another striker. I do think he'd probably be best out in the wing, but again, we'll try him at striker. He's got 90 finishing. We'll see what happens. Sule, oh boy, you just got knocked out of it, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Oh, send him through. Please just... Okay, I actually haven't mentioned this. I hate Kanalas so much. Oh my god. Yes, go across. That's a goal. Surely, let's go. He's gotten the ball taken off of him twice, but because he's so fast, he's so agile, he can get it right back, and it's a beautiful cross in. Oh, just go. Just go. Back post. Kudus! I think he's going to be that type of striker that passes and distributes, not like that pure goal-scoring striker. Get across! <sighs> Middle. Yes. Oh my god, that was gorgeous. Now here's the thing, right? I know Suleimana was not involved in that. It's the positioning though, right? He's putting himself in a spot where he's either going to be wide open for a tap-in goal or other players are going to be open. He's just doing his job. I can respect that. He's not being an idiot. And trust me, there are plenty of players who do not know how to not be an idiot. That pace, can you... Ugh. Dude, okay, how many interceptions? How many interceptions has he made? He's made like three interceptions. That should have been a goal if it wasn't for overpowered goalkeepers. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, Kamaldine, that's what I'm talking about, man. He's kind of tearing it up at striker. I'm a big fan of him so far. 4-0 at halftime. I think he was involved in two of the goals, at least in terms of goals and assists. However, in one of them, again, he was just playing striker, being where he's supposed to be, let other players pass around him. He's not trying to do too much, and that's what I appreciate about him. Can you put in a good ball? Oh, my sweet Jesus. Yes, you can. He can cross, too? What the f Oh my god, what a run. What a ball. Get it back across. Kudus, thank you very much. He can play any spot. That should be game. Thank god. I don't think I showed anything. I don't even think I showed them scoring because there was just no point. We win 6-1. And how many goal contributions did Suleimane have? Four. Four of them. Jesus. So, again, Suleimane did have one goal and three assists. But one thing I do want to point out is the amount of interceptions he had. He had three interceptions, which was tied for the most 
in the entire team. And the reason why I point that out is because he can be a very good pressing forward with that pace and that agility and that balance. He can move and shift from side to side really well. So if you lose the ball, you could be right back on someone because he's just relentless. He could easily be a pressing type of forward for you. And again, every single interception he made led to some sort of chance, whether it was a goal or again, just a shot on target. All right, now we have a Prem team with Sané just thrown in there. The mana from Ghana is about to take over, all right? I expect an, an equally good performance because I don't really know how you could top it besides, I guess, getting a hat trick. How the hell have I just done that with... Do we say anything? Do we just kind of bask in what we just witnessed? Like, I, I don't, I feel like if we say anything, it's just going to ruin it, right? Oh my god, dude, seriously, he is so goddamn fast. It is disgusting how just blazing this man is. Sule is there, it's supposed to go to Sule, still there. Don't know what the, what the hell is happening here. Oh my god, gets across! <laughs> Oh my god, is that why? Is that why? Oh my god, is that why he goes out wide? Did you see that? He went out wide. I, I assumed it was going to be just a bad positioning. Nah, he does that to just kind of make runs towards the inside. <laughs> in Christ, apparently three chem Sonic can just bang those in like it's nothing. <laughs> oh, f*** off. It's a corner. We really out here just conceding corner goals, huh? Oh, if you just cut in there, Sule, I think he's going to be off. Yeah, he is. That's that 78 attack positioning. Oh, Canales. Oh, <laughs> oh that was dirty. Oh, what a run from Can. Oh, that's Marino. Oh, oh boy. That's like two quick goals. Okay, okay. 4-2 at halftime. Did not really expect that to happen. Now, Suleimana has two goals and is somehow man of the match. I mean, I, I think David Neres, I think Canales did well. And Suleimana has been good. I, I think his best position might be out wide. But there are times where his, again, his attack positioning, it's 76, it's not the best. While he can finish, I think it's something that, again, it should be coming from the wing. Please be on. Please be on. Please be Oh, hey, hey! And that's a penalty! Let's go, Suleimana! Yeah, Alright, yeah, he's 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 getting on this. Of course he's getting on this. Going left? Nah, JK, down the There's a top shelf pen. That's I won't I won't hear otherwise. Alright, does the finesse work? I'm not really gonna say much. I do think that he'll still have it after it gets patched, because he does have the finesse shot trait. Right? Just like this. We're, we're, we're moving like clockwork now. That's another tackle slash interception. And that's going to be another assist as well. Dude, like, he's he's had four interceptions, at least total from what I can remember. And he, it's, it, two goals have come from it. A few more seconds. Just just call it, please. And just, just, just call it. Thank God. So it ends up being 9-2. Suleimana with four goals. I'm not sure how many assists he got, but he did... Potentially top that last game because he did actually get a hat trick. So he did get four goals, one assist. Had a fantastic game, both at striker and on the wing. Mostly did better at striker, but again, he was probably more involved there. So at least makes sense. All right, I think that's probably enough because if you don't think nine goal contributions in two games warrants him a place in your squad then I don't really know what else to tell you. Like, again, unless you have Neymar, and then he is going to be the best left winger for you in the French League. Saying that, there are a few downsides. One, his link ability, playing for Rene, being from Ghana in the French League. It's a little hard to link, again, unless you have these top, top pl uh, tier players like Mbappe, like uh, Abadi Pele, for example, who is also from League One in Ghana. That'd be a great hero to try him with. Along with that, his attack positioning is a little iffy because, we you know, we put him on that left wing and he was just essentially hugging the sideline he would never really come in a whole lot unless it was the you know unless the ball was completely on the other side of of the wing genuinely he could be a very very fun card and i think he's going to be a super sub for me for a very long time so that is going to do it for this review guys hopefully you did enjoy it thank you guys so much for watching this has been dmg peace